Hi, I'm Andrew Cherilambus from High Yield Hunter and I'm here to talk to you about properties. The question I need to ask you first is, is this a holiday home or are you buying an investment? If it's a holiday home, then I'm presuming you're going to be looking at maybe uh, Hurricane Alley, as they call it, maybe Florida or uh, one of the coasts. If that's the case, I strongly advise you check insurance costs. There are areas in America where you can insure a house for two, three hundred dollars. In Hurricane Alley, it's going to be two hundred to three hundred dollars per month, not per year. So make sure you're aware of the costs. So be aware of all the costs involved. The buying process is actually quite easy. Over here, buying a property can take two to three months with all the legals. In America, you can get it done within two to four weeks. So the process is very quick and as far as a deposit goes, $500 to $1,000 is normally a deposit so it's not that onerous. Legal costs mm, between three to $500. So the buying process is quite easy. The main concern when you're buying a property that you're going to live in yourself or use as a holiday home is what happens when you're not there. To leave an empty property maybe for 50 weeks of a year or something like that could be quite worrying. So why don't you look at trying to rent it while you're back in the UK? That way, you've got the letting agent to look after the property even when it's vacant. The one thing you must remember, in America, what we call council tax, they call property tax, whether the property is empty or occupied by somebody else, you as the owner have to pay. So once you've identified your target, as I said before about the buying process, a simple deposit $500 to $1,000. The time frame can be quick, two weeks, can be four. But look at the completion statement. Everything will be listed on that, and that's how to buy property in the USA.